hello friend uh, today we are going to see how we can uh, convert old kerosene lamp into a decorative place where we can use this old kerosene lamp uh, as in a night lamp at your in your bedroom or in your hall so this i got an old kerosene lamp okay which i have uh, which was rusted which i have uh, cleaned and i have painted with a silver color okay with a glass over it to convert this old kerosene lamp into an uh, uh, decorative piece uh, the components we need is uh, some of a step down transformer okay generally this is uh, 606 transformer some filtering capacitor over here and as this is a center type transformer I required a two diodes for a full wave rectifier over here and some LED strip or a LED lightning wire which is easily available in the market okay with all this material I've already prepared so here you can observe that I have taken one two diodes and uh, one filter capacitor which is 1000 microfarad 25 volt directly have connected over here uh, here I have used two uh, resistor of uh, half watt of 100 ohm so that I can get a step down voltage of 3 volt as the output of this transformer is 606 in 6 hold step down but I need a 3 hold so instead of using an, uh, a regulator so we apply a simple mathematical equation that is a voltage divider so here so V out equals to R2 upon R1 plus R2 into the total incoming voltage that is V in so here R2 uh, R1 so this is 100 ohm upon 100 ohm plus 100 ohm into incoming voltage that is a 6 volt over here so he get 1 upon 2 into 6 so you get 3 volt over here so we let's see the practical what is the output of the transformer and after applying a uh, voltage divider network what will be the amount of voltage will be getting at the output so as you can see here already i have built a uh, rectify here i have used a two diodes and i have added one filtering capacitor over here okay already i have given the connection to the mains and let's see the output uh, voltage of the rectifier so with respect to so it is 6.4 volt over here we are getting over here so as per our equation I have taken a 200 ohm half watt resistor which will be working like a voltage divider network over here so I have taken a 2 resistor of 100 ohm over here so I am going to apply this as a voltage divider network to light up LED as LED is going to be turned on at 3 volt over here if the over voltage may damage the LEDs strip over here now after applying um, a voltage divider network so here we can see so we are getting here 2.8 volt so as per the equation there is some drop over there so we are not getting a 6 volt but it is a 2.8 volt and if I turn on the LEDs here so these are the LED strips which is easily available in the market. Uh, so polarity over here of 
plus and minus over here. You can see the LED has been glowing over here. Okay, so this is working on three volt over here, step down transformer. Now, once I complete with the circuitry, I'm going to take this old kerosene lamp over here. So here is some space over here where I can fit a transformer over here with the help of some nuts or something. And I can take a output from over here of 230 volt, I see which is easy level over here. So I can fit my transformer nuts over here or somewhere here very easily over there. So here first improving this wires from over here. Okay. So I can put a wires. It's too long over here, so I can cut down. Here I have to apply some insulin tape over here. We applied the voltage divider network over here. 
now with the help of a soldering gun okay we should make it perfectly We have to remove the excess part of this right here. Mm -hmm. Again, for the safety purpose, I'm going to apply some insulator over here. Just cross verify whether it is working properly or not. You will see the voltage of it. Multimeter. So you can see the voltage was here. Once again, we can check in the multimeter what voltage we are getting across it. So here we are getting 2.84 volt over here. So we need a uh, 3 voltage over here. So this 2.84 is more than sufficient over here. So now we have to fix uh, a transformer inside this old kerosene lamp over here. You can see over here there are some holes over here so here I'm going to fix a transformer inside over here which is easily fitted over here inside so we had got some screws over here so you can fix it over here inside this chamber over here so we can fix a transformer over inside this over here with the help of a screws we need some screws over here and with the help of a nut bolt so we are going to fix it, fix it over here. 